Hello, this is Fiona from what was my channel? <laughs> Living like Poof <Thief> style. <laughs> what was it? Um, Living the life, but yeah, that's it. Hello, this is Fiona from Living the Life Food Style. So you might have seen my YouTube channel the other day when I produced um, some rabbit saddle and rabbit legs. Um, so I filleted the rabbit and I'm going to show you a simple recipe that's never been done before. So I hope it works. <laughs> the making use of the rabbit saddle. So if you want to come up close and have a look. So I've laid out the saddle here and I've seasoned it with salt and pepper. I've also made a egg wash to help the seasoning crumb to stick to the saddle. In this crumb we have almonds, we have herbs that have just been freshly been picked that include dill, parsley, wild oregano, thyme, <laughs> coriander, coriander, Tarragon. And tarragon. Also have some almonds in here and a bit of salt, a nice pinch of salt there. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to... Did you say oats? Yes, oats. I said oats. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I think I did anyway. Yeah. So I'm going to just... Do you put it in the egg first and then the flour? No. You put the flour straight Oh, in okay. The yeah, and then, yeah. sorry. And then um, and My the bad. flour helps the egg to stick right, to, but the, yeah. to the saddle. Got you, I'm yeah. Just dipping it in the egg wash here. Sure. And then simply pop it in the crumb. Nice. Then, and you've got a beautiful, if you want to come closer and see this crumb here. Ooh, ooh. Yes. Very professional. So let's put that to one side. No, no well, you're, you're blagging. <laughs> Straight in the pan, maybe? No, it's not straight. No, I'll do the cooking bit shortly. All right. I'm going to... That's it. Cross contamination. That's all right. Yeah, no cross contamination here. And I'll just close that. Mm -hmm. Put my fingers on the door. Good so good. I'm just going to do one more to show you. Another fillet there. We put it in the flour. This is gram flour. Rebecca's persuaded me to uh, to go different. There's nothing wrong with different, is there, Rebecca? Absolutely not. No. So, ground flour is made from chickpeas. Thank you. Rubbing it in the crumb again. Beverly, if there's any crumb left over, we will um, have it for breakfast. Tag it up for you. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, I'll cook these shortly. I just need to get the oil heated. Okay. Okay. Done. Yeah. So, we've got the goujons prepared beautifully in a pile. And we've got some oil, this is hot, ready for the goujons. <laughs> so I'm going to take the goujons and place them in. Do you like the word goujons? I do like the word goujons. <laughs> <laughs> this is all, uh, all this vlogging mm -hmm. malarkey. Yeah, you've got, uh, you got to sound like you know what you're doing. doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I've never done it before, but I still know what I'm doing. Yeah. So if you want to come in, you can see them. Cooking away. And how long would you cook these for, Fiona? Well, um, you can actually have rabbit saddle rare, so mm. only maybe a minute on each side. If really? That. Ooh. How would you like yours cooking, Rebecca? Oh, I do tend. I am a more rare girl, but I've mm. never had rare rabbit before, and um, I must admit, <laughs> um, I'm a little bit um, apprehensive. <laughs> so, shall we can do some? The varying okay. kind of, um, rarity. Cook, cookness? Mm -hmm. No, not a word, is it? What would it be? So they're crackling away nicely in the oil. I'm going to turn them over in a few seconds, mm -hmm. starting with the one that I put down first. Oh, very good. Yes. And shall we see? You might be brown underneath. If it's golden, oh, it's not quite ready. I was going to uh, say, I've been we'll filming. Just wait, we'll just wait until they're golden, mm -hmm. flip them over, and you can come back and film me when we have the finished article. Oh, marvellous. And then you can say what accompaniments okay. you've made to go with them. Lovely. Oh, well, I'd be famous. <laughs> Hello again. This is my good friend, Rebecca, and she's going to guide you through the accompaniments to our evening meal. Marvellous. Okay, over to you, Rebecca. 
Thank you. So as you can see, the goujons were a wonderful success. That's uh, all down to Fiona's masterful cooking. I think we might need to taste them first. Oh, that's true, actually. They look good, though, don't they? And <laughs> see how we feel tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can you really have rabbit wrap? Anyway, um, <laughs> so, yes, I've never, I've only ever really had rabbit in sort of stews with red wine and that kind of thing. So I was quite surprised when Fiona said, oh, you can have it just like chicken. And because we were going for the herb crust, I kind of thought, um, and I had some leftover <laughs> roast veg. I thought, let's go for a Mediterranean-esque feel. So as you can see here, um, just roasted up some simple vegetables. Mm, a little bit, a little bit charred, but it just adds to the flavour, you know, it's fine. Um, and then um, sweet potato with olive and sun-dried tomato, just a nice simple mash there. And um, obviously we need a little bit of liquid there. And um, I roasted some garlic and got some lemon juice, a bit of bouillon, is that how you say it, bouillon? Um, I think I put a bit too much in actually, but we'll see. And just a bit of water. So that's going to be our nice sort of light sauce to go with the deeper flavours. And um, yeah. Let's play it up. <laughs> I'm hungry actually, it's probably 10 past nine. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Okay, so we're ready to eat now and I'll just show you a close-up of the plate. Rebecca is the guinea pig. <laughs> it's a live streaming here. Mm. Do you know, that does really work. Yeah, I think you can pass it off as more of a chickeny thing. And um, nice crisp to it. Nice herby flavours coming through there. Um, I th I'd say this is a success. Well done, Fiona. Thank you. Um, living food lifestyle. Yeah? Sorry. Plump style. Plump. Oh, whatever. Yeah. Well, <laughs> do you want to wash it down with some pure Derbyshire water? Mm, this has actually been filtered in an alkaline water filter. Perfect.